In June 2008, Honda's first car, powered by a hydrogen fuel cell, rolled off the assembly line. But the safety, storage, and infrastructure issues surrounding hydrogen have left models like the FCX Clarity in short supply. One primary drawback to the technology is its weight. This enormous hydrogen tank is required to get the Clarity from point A to point B. Now Israeli scientists say they've come up with a way to shrink those massive tanks and bring hydrogen power to the masses. But we are claiming that we can store hydrogen in such a way that it will be more efficient than any other method that exists. The solution, they say, is these glass capillaries, only slightly thicker than a human hair. By bundling together thousands of them, scientists say they can fuel a car for about 240 miles. We are saying if we will replace what they are doing with what we are doing, we can reduce the weight, we can reduce the volume, and we can give better uh, quantities of hydrogen that we can put inside those uh, vessels. And we believe that what we are doing is safer. While its backers call the technology a breakthrough, they say it's unlikely to gain traction without a large injection of cash to scale up development. And a lack of infrastructure is still a lingering problem in making hydrogen power mainstream. But it is on the horizon. Nearly all the major car manufacturers have hydrogen designs in development. Mark Hamrick, The Associated Press.